They're tubers and homesteaders. How you doing? This is Carl from Desert Homestead and Linda. Well, we've been busy. Sorry about no videos last week, but heat is killing us out here. This is what we've been working on. Been working on putting addition to this trailer. We're boxing it in. This side here will be all our bathrooms, pantries, and that, and it'll be incorporated in. We're taking on this side, and we're not cutting the wall out. We're just putting the doors up to it and cutting out for the doors. And we got a door frame in. And there's a lot been going on on this. So we've been very, very busy. Wired in the lights for temporary to the backup lights on this. So we now have lights on the ground at night. This is another present my other half just got. One of our ladies here in town and Jim, Jim and Esther, been here for 45 years. Jim has been homesteading out here. Esther found this for Linda and I. She decided that we needed it for here to can and do, you know, the stuff that needs to be done. Because canning out here is a crucial thing. So a lot of things are going on. And this is our little pesky thing we come across this morning out in our temporary wood pile. It is a four or two foot western rattlesnake. It was just turned to dinner tonight. And if you look up on the frame, all this is reclaimed lumber. This is stuff that we brought in from the valley when we were working on, while I was salvaging. And the floor and everything else is all from salvage out of a barn. Turned out actually pretty good. Got a window in here, reclaimed window that was given to us when we were here. So this place is built on reclaim. Our plan is on the back edge to clear out to here, which is 16 feet. We're gonna cut this out, drop a beam work in here, and this is gonna go clear back inside which would give us another eight feet of kitchen. So this is all kitchen. There's a sink laid out here and that. All our plumbing is gonna be high up here in the house or yeah, here in the house. It's all gonna be high. We got tw uh, four 12 peak rafters going in, which is not really a bad deal. All our gutters and outlets are all going to a gray water cyst. So everything's kind of getting incorporated into one unit on this place. Our wiring is gonna be 12 and 110. We're probably going to have two receptacles with a GFI out here. We might have three. And then here is our wood cook stove sets right here. And when it gets all put in, this bottom section is our second 20, which runs out to 24 on that side, like the rest. We're digging down so we can walk underneath that nose. And we're going to make that into a li uh, library for our books and stuff. All this will be redone. We're dropping beams in right here on the back wall that are reclaimed lumber. And then in here is going a rock like hearth to our chimneys. Ray and Gail and Ray's been doing construction work for years. He built the Newport Hotel in Newport, Oregon on the coast. He's owned a lot of construction and done masonry all his life. So he's looking forward to spending some time out here working on this masonry. He's been supervising us for the construction checking on it, showing how to do it. But it's been going pretty good out here on the desert homestead. I mean, a lot probably clean up and stuff. We want to move the trailer, camper and stuff out of eyesight. We're going to leave the chicken pen where it's at. But it's turning out really good. Linda and me have been working, well, Linda and I, I should say, proper language. But Linda and I are been working our tail end off out here. We have to get the other side built and it's going to be really hard to do. We're getting low on timber, but we have a little bit left. I think we can finish the floor. And we got enough to do all the rafter, all the floor work and rafters on that side for the first 20. Our goal is to have this done before winter time. So I will keep you guys up to date and let you know what's going on here on the Desert Homestead. I appreciate you guys watching. Hope this helps out. If you got any comments or questions, go ahead and send us comments and we will answer you back. You have a good day, Carl and Linda on Desert Homestead.